What conditions have proven to be responsive to neurofeedback? That is a great question. I get asked that one a lot as well. You can imagine that if there's a way that we can change fundamentally the structure of the brain, the biochemistry of the brain, the way the brain is organized and communicating, that any of the conditions that are created, created by struggles in the brain could be altered through such a technology. And generally speaking, we find that that's true for neurofeedback. The range of conditions goes from ADD, ADHD, anxiety, panic disorders, OCD, depression, sleep disorders, migraines are improved dramatically. Even seizures are improved. In more recent years, it's been proven that neurofeedback helps with Alzheimer's disease. So as you begin to think about whether or not your situation or your child's situation can be improved with neurofeedback, I would say chances are it can be. Is anything effective 100% of the time? No, but in our clinic, it is often the case that we get remarkable change provided that parents and clients are willing to have a conversation about what it takes to become more forward focused in the way that they organize their home, their life, and their parenting strategies with their kids. And that's something we help our clients do here. In the last year to two years, neurofeedback has been categorized as a level four or five intervention for many mental health disorders. Now level five is as good as it gets with mental health issues. So level four or five is an excellent, excellent result. It's an excellent treatment and very few treatments can come close to that, particularly because with neurofeedback, when treatment is completed, things do not deteriorate. If you go off medication, if you're in therapy, uh, almost any other treatment, six months or a year later, things are worse. Neurofeedback, it is not that way. Because in essence, we've reorganized this brain. We've taken a brain that's kind of, uh, uh, it's not communicating well, it's shut down. And over time, the brain then reorganizes and it's functioning better. And it's more of a learning, growing machine at the completion of treatment, provided that a full treatment course is completed. So that brain is better able to learn, to grow, to function, to, to cope, to thrive, to to feel better and function better in so many ways. So it's very exciting as the research over the last 10 years has proven that neurofeedback is among the best interventions out there with no side effects and remarkable capacity for sustained growth over time. Hi, I'm Dr. Randy Kale. If you have more questions, you can reach out to my office. I'll be happy to set up a consult and speak with you. If you, if you decide to choose neurofeedback, I wish that you'd give us a call and give us a chance to serve you or your family. Take care now.